essential maneuver for tandem canoeing is the pivot turn. Let's start with a pivot to your onside using a pair of draw strokes. To do the draw stroke, reach out, plant your paddle in the water, and pull your canoe over to it. As your canoe nears your paddle, and before it runs over your paddle, turn your blade and knife it back out for the next stroke. To get some power in in this stroke, reach out with your upper body, put your weight on your paddle, and then really pull the canoe over your paddle using your torso. Because you're pulling the canoe to your paddle, your body will actually end up back in the canoe and balanced when your paddle comes out of the water. That's a good thing. You'll find that if you're kneeling, this whole reaching out and putting your weight on your paddle thing will feel a lot more comfortable. To pivot the canoe to your offside, the stern person can do a pry, and the bow person can do a cross draw. To make the stern pry efficient, make sure you start the pry stroke right up against the back of the canoe. It's the first few inches of the stroke that generate the turning power. To get some power into your cross draw stroke, shovel the water under the bow of the canoe and push out with your top grip hand. Since both people are doing a stroke on the same side of the canoe, you're going to want to lean away from your paddle stroke a bit so the canoe doesn't, well, tip. So now you're hurtling towards shore. And when you get there, you do a pivot to turn your canoe so you're parallel to the shore. But now what? It's pretty hard to turn your canoe and end up right against the shore. It's time to learn how to side slip the canoe. If you do a combination of strokes, a pry and a draw, the canoe will move sideways. The secret to side slipping your canoe evenly is for the stern person to keep an eye on the angle and let the bow paddler know if they're pulling too hard. It's a lot easier for one person to slow down a bit, let the other person catch up, than it is to be yelling at the other person to speed up. Grab that rock.